Welcome, welcome everybody, it's Seth Low here. Today I'm playing Borderlands 2, and today I'm going to show you how to get Torque Tokens very easily. Now, what you want to do is head to Sanctuary or to any place with a fast travel station. Now, uh, once you get to the fast travel station, you're going to want to go to the bar, which is part of the DLC for Mr. Torque's campaign. Now, once you're at the bar, you're going to want to head out get a car into the badass creator of badassitude now you're going to want to head to pyro pete's bar which is located somewhere in the top right i don't understand why i was hesitating for that either we're going to head to the top right uh, i'm going to speed it up right here and you're going to need to get a car of some sort to get a bandit vehicle with a uh, barrel tossing it destroys the bikes in one hit if you encounter any it's not that far away, just take the road and you shall uh, hit a little hill that will turn, that will be on your left. Just go up that hill and down that pathway, should be, yep, yeah, right there, little pathway. Now that will take you in to Pyro Pete's, or near Pyro Pete's, it's called the Beat Down. But it takes you to Pyro Pete's place, or bar. There's going to be a couple of mobs in your way. If you're mean, you have the turrets upgraded. Should be no problem. Just throw the turrets down. They'll kill them for you. There should be a sign that we just passed that says Power of Pizza is down this way. Now up here, you will see the entrance to the bar and a little reviving new use station, I believe. So enter in the Pirates Pete bar. Now in the bar, there is a Mr. Torx vending machine, which always has a legendary as the item of the day. Which is actually pretty good because you have a place to spend your torque tokens. Now, you're going to need to get all the way up to the Pyro Pete's bar blitz. Now, you don't really have to kill Pyro Pete. You just have to get to this point because then that's the that's where you get the torque tokens. Now, for t tier 3, you get um, 20 per uh, victory. And this uh, quest goes on for the maximum of 2.5 minutes. So, if you're a slow killer, pick up your pace here. But it should be fine as long as you have a shotgun and that's fire. Because the majority of the people in here do not have shields or they are very weak shields. Uh, you, you do have to kill these badass uh, people. They're the only badasses in here so they won't be that hard. And besides, the uh, machines or the people tend to have fights with each other for some reason. I don't know. I never had difficulty staying uh, or getting down here. Usually, the majority of the time that I kill myself is due to self-error, because I have these mash grenades that do a lot of damage. Now, uh, each time you kill one of these things, they drop a green item. Uh, I think they drop something else, and they drop a torque token. Sometimes they drop a blue item or two, which is pretty nice, so... You can get some free gear while you're at it, but after you're done, after you're done killing them, which shouldn't take you long, it's two and a half minutes. Probably can finish in about one minute and a half if you're good enough. And then you can, it repeats on forever, so, and there's an ammo dump right here, so you can just refill yourself, unless you're Gunzerker, then that won't be an issue for you, and then you can sell all the crap that you've carried, including mod. it drops anything from skins to mods to guns. I've gotten a couple of uh, purple of SMGs from this place, so not that bad, and once you get enough, you always buy your items here. So thank you guys for watching, and if you enjoyed it, please thumbs up and comment. See you guys.